Global Education Monitoring Report is precisely what it said. It's a global report that focuses on global trends, trying to synthesize and find the most interesting common features uh, that give a, a global perspective of where the world moves in terms of uh, education and the SDG 4 target. Uh, the report is now launching a new series of regional reports, and we're actually scheduling a regional report on inclusion in Latin America and the Caribbean. This will be launched three months after the global launch, so we expect the, the regional reports to be uh, uh, presented in June 2020. And even if we move at the speed of the best performing countries, still a very large number will not be achieving minimum literacy and numeracy skills um, when they finish primary and secondary school. At the same time, we know that results in education take a long time to materialize. And we know that many countries are moving in, in the right direction. So our second publication reviewed what countries perceived as their main contributions to achieving the SDG 4 targets. And we found very interesting examples from all around the world in how countries are trying to uh, increase uh, their emphasis on learning, their emphasis on equity, uh, their broadening of the curriculum, their in incorporation of the education needs of youth and adults, um, also how they try to collaborate with uh, sectors outside education to achieve the common objective. And finally, how they also try to learn from each other by taking part uh, in international events like this forum here in Cali on inclusion uh, in education. <laughs>